Welcome back. Every October, residents across the Twin Tiers and the world come to Steuben County for the annual Wine Glass Marathon. And the marathon has changed its course over the years. In this week's Road to the Wine Glass Marathon, WY's Logan Wilson takes a look at the history of the race. Logan. The Wine Glass Marathon has not always been popular. It's been around for about 34 years now, but in the early 90s, it almost came to an end. The race was started in 1982 by a local podiatrist. Maybe he was trying to get business. I'm making a joke, but he knew a lot of runners because he was a podiatrist and he was a runner himself. So he started it and he kept it going for about five years, but then his professional responsibilities pulled him away. The race continued to change hands for many years, which often left the future of the race in question. The history of the race may seem far-fetched as it has become a top marathon in the United States. So we're at a level now, I think, where the right people are involved and it's going to continue to grow as a draw. It can't grow any more than the number of people, but more people will come. On top of being on the steering committee, Dave has run the race 28 times and has volunteered for the past 10 years. For people that aren't from around here, they come to see what to me is one of the most beautiful parts of the country and that's how it's grown so much. It's become a destination marathon because Finger Lakes and Corning itself are, are great places to go. The Wine Glass Marathon is now ranked one of the top marathons in the world, and the race coordinators hope that the popularity continues for years to come. Reporting in Corning, Logan Wilson, WENY News.